Hi, my name is Jared Miller with West Safety Services, and today I wanted to talk to you about 911. What's the problem? Why are people talking about it so much? Why is it so important? And I think what it comes down to is a statement that was made by the FCC, which is, if we get better at deploying emergency services for users, and we're talking about enterprise users here, so we're talking about your users, we're talking about your voice infrastructure, we're talking about dial tone, I am in presence, all of these great things that we're deploying to our users to make them more efficient. If we get better at providing these services to them, we can save over 10,000 lives a year. That's as a direct relationship as we can make. It's all about 911. And what we need to understand is that all of these new technologies, all these great uh, features and capabilities that we're trying to deploy to our users are breaking 911. So what is that traditional understanding? What's What's our intuitive response when somebody walks up to us on the side of the road and says, how does 911 work? What do we expect? What is the technology that underpins it? Well, we expect, I think this is generally uh, true, that if we pick up the phone and we get dial tone, we're going to be connected to the right place. Someone who can listen to our emergency, our strife, and dispatch appropriate health, potentially, even without us having to say a word. Maybe we're choking, maybe we're too distressed to speak, maybe we're running away from a shooter. Whatever that worst case scenario is, we depend upon these services, we depend upon that intuitive understanding of how the technology works. Well, in terms of actual technology, that's all based upon this fixed infrastructure. As a business, we go to a telco. We say we'd like a business telephone line. We'd like a certain number range to be deployed across it so that we can make telephone calls. So in those worst case scenarios, we can dial 911. Because it's regionally deployed, because it's copper in the ground, it's not moving, we can assume that it's going to get to the right place, that it's going to get to the regionally specific 911 operator center for us. That they will be as efficient as we expect them to be in their response. Well, when we move to these IP technologies, when we move to these capabilities that are all about unpinning our users from physical location in terms of their capabilities to use all of these great features that make them more efficient, that they can take business communications where they need to, whenever they need to, despite physical location, we are breaking 911. We need solutions when we make this transition that will support each and every one of those features and capabilities because at the end of the day, it is about saving lives. It is about those 10,000 lives that we can save when we've got the right 911 and safety solutions in place.